Right to low, everyone. Here we are. Hole number one, Maple Bay. Brand new course. And now that we don't have a tailwind, I just wanted to kind of give you guys another perspective here. So let's see what this looks like. Might need to kind of change the way that we spin this a little bit, but for the most part, you'll probably see me just try to uh, sneak over this bunker here and try to position this into the fairway. So it's about a three ring plus some curl, more so than anything, plus a little bit of overpower. So I'm thinking, you know, somewhere around here. <clears throat> And just over the bunker, probably a little bit closer, closer than it should have been. So do make sure that you're adding the necessary steps because you definitely don't want to wind up in that bunker. Uh, the way that I'm going to approach this is just going to be slightly different. Or that's not what I meant. I meant uh, pretty much the... I'm going to pretty much just kind of stick to the to my last approach. And you can see for the most part, you can kind of get away with these earlier, earlier ball types, especially if you can avoid the par fives. Hole two isn't too bad. Um, I'm, I'm assuming hole five might not be too bad. I'm a little bit worried about hole nine. It might be the one hole that you want to bring out a titan ball or something now i am going to be down towards min a bit here somewhere down here i'm thinking 1.8 ish rings maybe plus some ball guide offset or something i'm just going to try to maybe land right around here And sure enough, there it is. Yet again. So let's see what my opponent can do. Oh, just a little bit off. So as you can see, you know, the backspin approach here is going to be good. It's going to give you a uh, good chance there. So, um, you know, highly recommended there. Um, I will catch you guys on the next hole. Good luck there.